please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What's up Raptors? Today is Thursday, April 18th. I hope you guys had a wonderful week. We are so close to finishing it, so keep working hard. You guys got this. Now on to the daily news. Block schedule lunches. On 135 days, you will have your third period teacher's lunch, and on 246 days, you will have your fourth period teacher's lunch. Lunches with Alyssa and Priscilla. Wednesday, April 15th, chili cheese fries, a red apple, and a cookie. Thursday, April 18th, chicken cheese on a burrito, refried beans, and fruit gelatin. Friday, April 19th, a pizza slice, chopped romaine salad, and a green apple. Name? Ryan. What grade are you with? Seven. What's your favorite side dish? Sun mashed potatoes. Okay, thank you. Okay. What grade are you with? Eight. Would you recommend fried chicken? Yeah. And why? Macadillious scrumptious. Name? Superman Raul. What grade are you in? Eight. Do you like fried chicken? Oh, why? It's just guys. Have, Have a, a good, good day, day Raptors. Raptors. Shut up. PE by Michaela. Recently, PE did a fishing unit. These are what kids thought about it. What grade are you in? Six. What do you think about the fishing unit in PE? It's pretty fun. Adrian. What grade are you in? Six. What did you think about the fishing unit in PE? It was really fun. It was also easy. Um, the only thing I didn't really like is like, kind of like, there's only one little spot that you had to get the hook in, and it's just kind of hard. Yeah. Um, what grade are you in? Eight. What did you think about the fishing unit in PE? It was really fun. It was also easy. Um, the only thing I didn't really like is like, kind of like, there's only one little spot that you had to get the hook in, and it's just kind of hard. These are some pictures of how it went. What did you think about it? Have a great day, Raptors. Radical Raptors by Evan Phelps. Today I asked a teacher who they wanted to nominate for Radical Raptors. What is a Radical Raptor? Radical Raptor, a student who always is hardworking and always pays attention to class. It's Condon. What grade do you teach? I teach 8th grade science and 7th grade AVID. Um, who do you want to nominate for Radical Raptors? I'm choosing to nominate Emily W. She's one of my 7th grade AVID students. Emily is an amazing student. She comes to class prepared every day. She puts a ton of effort into all of her work. She writes amazing TRFs for our tutorials and overall is just an awesome human to have in class. Thank you. How do you feel being nominated for Radical Raptors? Emily. What grade are you in? Seven. How do you feel being nominated for Radical Raptors? I feel good. Thank you. Bye, Raptors. Teacher of the Week with John. The Teacher of the Week is... Miss Gonzalez. How do you feel about winning Teacher of the Week? I'm excited to win it because I come to school every day passionate to teach, and I teach five different subjects, so I work really hard. What else would you like to say? Students keep coming to school to learn because we're happy to teach you, and he's really cute. What's your favorite thing to do in Ms. Gonzalez's class? Play all the math and centers and do quizzes games. Why do you like Ms. Gonzalez's class? Congratulations, Miss Gonzalez. Vote for your favorite teacher if you haven't already. Bye, Raptors. What's your name? Miss 
Condon. What grade do you teach? I teach 8th grade science and 7th grade avid. Uh, did you see the clips last week? I did. We were able to stand out in the commons with a bunch of other students at the end of 3rd period and the beginning of 4th period to see the solar eclipse. Why do you wear the glasses to see it? It's really important to wear the specific glasses for the solar eclipse because you can cause severe damage to your eyes. You can actually burn your eyes by looking at the uh, solar eclipse in the sun without any type of protection. So those glasses are there just to make it a little bit safer for everybody. Okay, thank you. Have a great day, Raptors!